what group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Now you only need to say one, so but let's practice them both. Africans. People from Africa. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? The Louisiana Territory or Louisiana. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Here again, you only need to choose one, the War of 1812. The Mexican-American War. The Civil War. The Spanish-American War. Name the U.S. War between the North and the South. Here again, you only need to say one. The Civil War or the War between the States. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Most of my students say slavery. But there are two other reasons. One, economic reasons, or two, states' rights. What is one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? The most common answer is freed the slaves. But you can also say freed the slaves through the Emancipation Proclamation. Another answer would be saved or preserved the Union. A third answer, if you really want to impress the officer, is lead the United States or led the United States during the Civil War. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? So here, the number one answer is freed the slaves. But you do have four other choices. Freed the slaves in the Confederacy. Freed the slaves in the Confederate States. And finally, freed the slaves in most southern states. Okay, now we're on to the American flag. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies or because the stripes represent the original colonies. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Because there, there is one star for each state. Or you can also say because each star represents a state. And then finally your last choice is because there are 50 states. Choose whichever one is the best for you or the easiest to remember. Well, that concludes chapter four, so we'll see you again soon. Bye.